So I've got everything all set up. So this is my tether. This is my lineman's. This has my bow strap, uh, bow string. And then this third accessory pouch that I mounted right on the back. Back left side, this has all my camera gear in it. This has the camera, the lens, it has the microphone, and let's just double check in a flashlight on the side. And this is just one of those that I'll carry in with me and shine if I need to. But yeah, that's it. I got everything swapped over. Uh, this is the lineman, girth hitched on the lineman's loop. And then here's for the bridge, and I did a double girth on that just because this loop was a little larger than I liked. Uh, got the AM seal pressic with my assist. That's how it'll work. And then that's tucked into here. But there's my tether in there. Uh, there's a couple extra carabiners and Prusix out of AM steel tucked in the bottom of here just in case. Um, I always keep three already pre made Prusix on me. And that's for one for my lineman. One for my bridge, or yeah, one from one from my lineman, one from my bridge, one from my tether, and that's just worst case scenario. Yeah, so either way, got those done. Got the rest of my arrows made. Had to get all the tips. Had to get new ones, or I say new. Had to get more. And, uh, yeah, well, I was at the co-op today. They were having the, um, their gun shelf was everything was 50% off. So I ended up getting this. It's a lower end kit, <clears throat> which made in America has a lifetime warranty on it. So, yeah, we'll put this on the, uh, the wife's AR. And that one has, a. Uh, short barrel as a laser dot sight uh, as a geisley two-stage flat face trigger on it and uh, that thing is sweet that thing is sweet but um yeah that'll be nice little accents for the black and purple so the only thing i didn't get was the charging handle um which they didn't have it in stock i don't think they will but uh, I mean, I can always find it online with this brand. So Arma Spec. So I mean, it shouldn't be too hard to find the purple charging handle to match this. But it comes with everything. Everything minus the handle itself. So yeah, less than uh, after tax, it was like thirty-seven. And some change something like that so can't complain I'm pretty happy with this it was the last one they had in stock they had uh, some anodized blue and then uh, anodized red ones but here's my pack set up so you guys probably seen these backpacks at Walmart where it has a little outside carrier pocket well i stuck stuffed my platform in that and then i buckled that in on both sides and then once that was buckled in i ran a molly molly loop the clip or a strap whatever you want to call it and uh ran that around there strapped that to my legs or my sticks and now it's all together uh the only other things inside this backpack is this top step has my, they're the Hawk foldable steps. 
So this is this between my stand, top platform of the sticks, and this. There's not a side of the tree that I cannot reach. So that's in case I got a very large tree that I'm on. Uh, only thing else inside this bag, which I don't want to do it in one handed. But under this, I have a padded cushion that's up against the back part of it. Um, it's like you can get them at Walmart. They're the little, about an inch thick foam cushions for sitting. Um, that has a, like a little strap with a clip. So I took that off my seat and put that in my backpack. That's for back cushion when I'm carrying this stuff. And then when I get in the tree, I take that padding, I wrap it around the tree and I cinch it tight and that's my knee pad. Well then right in front of that is my camera arm. And that is it. There's the camera arm over there. There's the top unit to the camera head. Um, and then I got my ratchet straps to mount the whole camera to the, te to the tree and everything. The only thing that I'm missing that I normally would carry with me is a thermos of coffee. And then deer calls. So that's pretty much my pack setup. I got a little cup holder right here. Which this gets mounted to the tree for my coffee cup. And then I got an extra pair of gloves and a knife, worst case scenario, whether I got to kill a coyote or fight something off, which I likelihood of that ever happening slim to none. But yep, so that's pretty much a quick and short pack dump as far as what I walk in with. I always have that on. This is always on my back and I got my bow by my side. So, yes sir. You guys take it easy. Hopefully I'll uh, get a couple coyotes tomorrow. We'll see.